What's up Idol Tantan here and welcome back to another video of Basic Photography Part 2. Thank you so much for keep coming back to my channel. But before that, let's see the intro before we roll. Let's go! Last time, we talked about the rule of third which is one of the most fundamental used technique in photography. In today's video, we're going to discuss the centered composition and symmetry. I see a lot of people use this technique, but let me share with you what is the real meaning of it in photography. A good composition will help you create incredible and amazing photos so that it is more balanced, interesting, and pleasing to the eye. Symmetry refers to a line that split an object in half, and if both sides of the object are exact mirror image of each other, then this object is said to be symmetrical. The line that split a symmetrical object is called the line of symmetry. Symmetry is a powerful tool that lets you automatically create harmony and a sense of aesthetically pleasing balance and proportion in a photo. Although there are many types of symmetries, but today we're going to focus on two types, which is the horizontal and vertical symmetry. Let's start with the vertical. A vertical symmetry is the most common type of symmetry. Draw an imaginary line at the center of your composition. If both sides are equal or balanced, then your photo will look visually appealing. A vertical symmetry is often used in architecture photography. It emphasizes the size, shape, and the design of the structure. Let me show to you some of the sample photos of vertical symmetries. The second type is the horizontal. A horizontal symmetry are often used in landscape photography, especially when a body of water is present. This can be confused with reflective symmetry. The difference is that horizontal symmetry doesn't necessarily have to feature a reflection. A reflective symmetry always does. Here is the sample photo. A lake will perfectly reflect and add texture to a landscape. As you can see, I put or I place it horizontally at the center of the composition. A symmetrical photography will show you how to add more depth, vibrance, and clarity to your image. Take note, you don't have to pursue symmetry photography in your entire life, but give it a try at least once to see for yourself. Remember, this is just only a guide, and always put in your mind, the rules is sometimes meant to be broken. At the end of the day, it's all up to you. Before we end, I would love to shout out to The Mushroom, producing a tasty, delicious, mushroom burger and a very healthy beverage located in Malolo City, Bulacan. I will put the link down below so you can contact them. Behind the scene is Aldrich, Jerwin, JF, Bajo, Jevery, and Tam. Yun! <laughs> and that's it for today mga idol. Thank you for watching until the end and please don't forget to subscribe and hit the notification bell so that every time I post a new video, you'll get notified. Once again, this is Jonathan Sanchez aka Tantan. We make a living by what we get. We make a life by what we share. Ingat kayo mga idol! Have a good day and God bless you. Let's go!